hello good viewers and welcome in today's tutorial we are going to be solving this math olympiad okay so we have the question 3x plus 3 over x equals root 18 okay then what is the value of x to the power of 333 plus 1 over x to the power of 333 so now i would like you to stay focused and see what we are going to do so now i'm going to start from here okay so let me write the left hand side as a single fraction and that is going to be but before that you can see i have three here and i have three here so this is telling us that the three is is common we're going to have three okay into the bracket we factorize this x plus this will be one over x then equals now we have root 18 here this root 18 can be split as 9 okay multiplied by 2 so now from there you can see that we have 3 x plus 1 over x then equals this root 9 is empty as 3 then i have root 2 so now from here you can see that we can reduce this equation by dividing through by 3 this we cancel this i have x plus 1 over x then equals root 2 okay so now let me call this equation 1 we have we have actually reduced it so now we continue from here by squaring the both sides of this uh, equation 1 square or squaring equation 1 so this is going to be x plus 1 over x all squared equals root 2 all squared so now from there we can see that this is taking the form of a plus b all squared which will give us a squared plus 2ab plus b squared which is the uh, perfect square quadratic so now from there the next thing we're going to do is that so this is like my a and this is like this so this is going to be x squared right plus i don't need to put this there anymore but let's continue i mean the parentheses so x squared plus 2 multiplying a is x multiplying b is 1 over x then plus 1 over x all squared okay comparing this with this then equals we are having this this we cancel this here this will be two are you following so now from there i have x squared plus you know that x we cancel this x here i'm left with two then plus here is going to be one square is going to be one over x squared then which is equals two so now i can have this to be x squared plus 1 over x squared now i will take this or transpose this to the other side this will be 2 minus 2 then i have x squared plus 1 over x squared equals 0 right so let's call this equation 2 now since we have that equation 2 now let me write this equation 2 in a single fraction and that's going to be let's write this as over 1 I'm going to be having x squared, right, to be the LCM. Then we are going to have x to the power of 4, right, then plus 1 equals 0. So now from here, this x raised to power 2 cannot be 0. So the only one that can be 0, because if this x raised to power 2 be 0, it will turn to so, uh, undefined. So the only one that can be 0 is this. S to the power of 4 plus 1 equals what? Equals 0. Then we can rewrite this to be S to the power of 4 equals minus 1. Now let's keep this 1. Okay, because we are going to what? We are going to use it. Right? So now from there, let's move on. So now what they now ask us to find what they ask us to find now now 
what we are looking for is x to the power of 333 plus 1 over x to the power of 333 now what we are going to do is let me take this first x to the power of 333 you know it can be splitted as x to the power 332 multiplied by x to the power of 1 that is from the law of indices so now from there i'm going to rewrite this in terms of x you know this 332 can be expressed as having 4 okay multiplying 83 x to the power of 1 okay so now from there we're going to have what we're going to have this we can write this as x to the power of 4 x to the 83 multiplied by x are you following now this is the idea this is the reason why because common sense this is the reason why we got what we got this x to the power of 4 minus 1 because we're going to do substitution okay so therefore let's move on so x to the power of 333 is now equal to, according to what we have x to the power of 4 to the power of 83 then x so now what they ask us to find which is this we are going to write it in this form like having x to the power 3 will be x to the power of 4 okay then to the power of 83 dot x to the power of 1 then equals okay plus 1 over x to the power of 4 to the power of 83 multiplied by x so now according to what we have here so we already have x to the power of 4 to be what to be minus 1 according to what we have here so x to the power of 4 is minus 1 here so we are going to replace it so wherever you see we have minus 1 to the power of a to the power 3 multiplied by x plus 1 over minus 1 to the power of 83 then multiplied by x so now from here so we have something if you have minus a to the power of n when n is odd so the result is going to be give us negative but now when you look at this one now if you have minus one you can see minus one here is raised to an odd number which is 83 so therefore we are going to have the result to be minus one so this is going to be minus one okay that is minus x plus one minus 1 then x sorry over 1 over x so now this is what i'm saying here here we're going to have minus x plus 1 over minus 1 then multiply by what multiply by x because x is down here so now forget about this one this one here i mistake is supposed to be a okay it's denominator right here so now we're going to have from here we're going to have minus x we have we consider this negative sign we affect this one we're going to have minus one over what one over x so now from here let us factorize this minus outside so it's going to be minus into bracket x plus one over what one over x so now we should recall that from equation one here we have x plus one over x so let's recall that from from equation one here we are giving x plus one over x to be equal to root two so therefore we are going to replace it back here so therefore we're going to have what we're going to have minus right root two okay so now finally we are having x to the power of 333 
plus 1 over x to the power of 3, 3, 3 to be equals minus what? Minus root 2. And that's the solution. Okay? So now if you find this class very interesting, kindly share this to your colleagues so they can benefit from it. Bye-bye.